I'd like to thank my fellow trustees for their continued support uh, on the acclamation this evening. On their behalf, I would like to acknowledge the uh, settlement that we now have with our OECTA group. We uh, do true have, truly have a very dedicated team of teachers in our Catholic schools. I'd also like to thank our senior administration for all their hard work in ensuring that we reached a fair and equitable agreement that recognizes both the operational needs of the board and the valuable work that our teachers do. We've had numerous successes and achievements over the past year, and I would like to highlight just a few of them. The Idea Lab, where we had our photos taken this evening, an innovative workspace and approach to generating ideas and input from an, our entire school community here at Kennard Catholic. Mental health initiatives such as Talk Today. I heard the interview on CBC Radio on Monday as I was driving to Thunder Bay, and it's evident that we are taking a leadership role in some of the mental health issues such as suicide prevention. A very successful spiritual development day led by uh, Sister Angela Zakowski that helped us focus on our Christ-centered mission. The inclusion of student voice in our board improvement planning where we saw 12 students from across the board providing their input from the student perspective. Our ongoing commitment to our five-year strategic, strategic plan entitled Our Journey, Our Faith, Our Joy. St. John's School achieving the Franklin Covey Lighthouse Milestone on April 16, 2015, and the recent launch of their video, which is a must-see. The ongoing implementation of the Leader in Me process at St. Marguerite Bourgeois. The unique learning pods at St. Louis School that have opened up new learning opportunities for our students. The Do Unto Others program at PJP that focuses on building character skills such as kindness, compassion, empathy, and cooperation. St. Thomas Aquinas graduation that saw 94 students receive their diplomas. I trust we will be looking to exceed the 100 mark very shortly. And there is so much more. I'm sure that I speak for all trustees when I say that we're extremely proud of all these accomplishments and that we are humbled and honored to serve in this calling. I want to acknowledge the leadership role of our clergy as well as their continued participation in our school masses and preparation of students for the sacraments. I want to wish everyone a very blessed Christmas, and I want to thank God for blessing our family with a newborn baby girl on Monday, another future student for Kenora Catholic District School Board. <laughs> God bless and Merry Christmas. Thank you very much to my fellow trustees for their uh, trust in uh, being acclaimed this afternoon or this evening. Thank you, and congratulations, Teresa. Thanks.